Good evening. Oh, forgot my camera. Oh, almost out of battery. Give me a second. Camera's gonna have to be off for a little bit because my phone needs to charge. <sighs> Excuse me. Hold triangle to enable menu narration. Press cross to start. Let's change that username. Hold triangle to enable menu. Right, so which is selected? You asked me once about this memory. I lied. I told you it was lost. I worried the wrong lesson would be learned. But this man lived many lives, and he has much to teach us. Of course, when he came to us, he was little more than a common thief, scrambling to survive on the streets of Baghdad, dreaming of a better future. Wait, Not why just for himself, but for all those he saw suffering on the margins. <laughs> for while he lived in a golden age, at the heart and the height of the Abbasid Caliphate, scratch its gilded surface and you'd find a rot beneath. The Order of the Ancients fought to rise and spread their cruelty through the land. The Hidden Ones, as we were known then, resisted. 
Right. Striking at our enemy from the shadows, an eternal struggle. Centuries ago, he was at its heart. Basim ibn Isaac. He honored the creed. He challenged it. So must we. We have it in all of us to mistake the shadows we walk for the light we serve. The time may come when we will be tested as he was. I fear that time is coming soon. This is a nightmare. Was it the Jinni again? And what did our friend want this time? <coughs> to strip the flesh from my bones? Dine on my innards? Never has much to say, yet it leaves its mark. I can still feel it crawling on my skin. Hardly original. You should tell it as much. Forget the Jinni for the moment. The day is new. There is work to be done. Your wish has left another contract. Who for? Them again? We would make more money selling water to a camel. <sighs> Come, Nihal. Where is your sense of duty? Duty does not fill our bellies. No. But it does enrich the soul. I will be outside. <laughs> Trace not a full fledged assassin yet. Hold on, what was that? I told Nihal this would be impossible to sell when she stole it, but she could not resist. Wonder what it is about these ancient baubles that fascinates her so. Kick up some sand, Basim. The sun casts a long shadow. Let us not keep Durwish waiting. I cannot bear another lecture. These contracts. <laughs> It is quite a few Darwish has pushed your way now. He knows I will come through. You have his trust. That much is clear. Do you suppose you have theirs? These shadowy types? I should hope so by now. Then they should show it. You take all the risk and they offer little in return. They are liberators, Nihal, not merchants. I know the stories. Still, the price of liberty should be enough to feed us. Wow. About this contract, I do not want you to mistake my words for pestering. I am only looking out for you, Yasadiki. It is no inconvenience to stand up to our oppressors as the hidden ones do. 
Do you think yourself some hero of tomorrow? The next Gilgamesh? <coughs> no. I am merely the son of a public servant who dedicated his life to the betterment of his people. <coughs> Only to be slighted and forgotten. But I am honored you think I could reach such heights. I may just aim for them. <laughs> that is not at all what I said. It is what I heard. Shaky. Such crowds. Something important must be happening. The Khalifa has been summoned to the Winter Palace. It is surely his wealthy retinue that drives this crowd. Ah, perhaps they're in the mood to offer donations. Ah, I see your meaning. A little sleight of hand to sharpen our wits. If this contract will not feed us, the Hilafa might as well. <laughs> that merchant has left his purse on the table. An easy one to begin with. <laughs> Better leave before they notice. Come here! Ready yourself. I will pick them out. A keen eye and an agile hand. A formidable <coughs> duo. Mm. There. The boisterous one. He must have something of value. What could be more important? Come here, please. That's it. Sneaky, sneaky. <coughs> and over there, by that stall, she's got some coin. Well done. You truly are the master thief of Anbar. Is that jealousy I hear? Hardly, O oh great looter of purses. Insufferable. Come, we are late to Durwishes. That's a rift on garden. That's cool. Some cabbages and wheat. It's that him. They're all looking spry. I wonder what tales we will hear Peace, today. I mean, how is your knee? Much better, Basil. Wrapped it and rested a few days, like you said. Good. So long as each day is better than the last, and you take care not to extend yourself, you will recover fine. Has this happened to you before? Is that why you know how to treat it? I am no stranger to scrapes and bumps, but I have learned to prevent them. And so should you, if I may. Your sandals are worn and cannot grip the ground. Your knees are taking the brunt of your movements. We need to find you something better, something that fits. But that part is not so easy. The mosques are plenty. I am sure to find a better pair there, uh, if you will not pass judgment. Ha! Do not look to me. That will be between you and Allah, ya Sadiqi. They are all looking spry. I wonder what tales we will hear today. Talk with me. Basim, the Khalifa has arrived with his court. Have you seen them? I have not. 
Though I did meet some of his merchants at the markets. I saw them up close. Al Mutawakil is much, much larger than I had imagined. A towering man indeed. Of course. He gorges on food served with the finest spices you and I can only hope to one day taste. I heard whispers of an important visit, but I cannot say from whom. I am sworn to secrecy. Let me guess. Hala, the palace guard's daughter. What? How did you know? I know where you really go when you say you are fetching water. She is kind, a good friend to you. And maybe more someday. Oh, Basim. I am serious. She will keep you out of trouble. You could use that. See you, Fahmi. Tall ones, most certainly. Ahlan, Basim, come here, come here. Steal anything? Vai, 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 vai. Here is the lazy boy. I've been waiting on you. Someone has to plan our meals. <coughs> oh, food. I would not flaunt that around the markets. Trust me. Go to Saridas. <laughs> she uses lots of butter. That <laughs> she does. You look weary. Are you well? It is nothing a little adventure will not fix. What do they need? A shipping ledger at the harbor. It is worth nothing by itself. But the information it contains is valuable to them. This is child's play. Do they not have anything more difficult? I can do more. Never mind your ego. The Khalifa's guards are here in number. And you would do well to remember that. You worry for me more now than when we lived in Baghdad. My worry is the same. I've only grown too old and too tired to hide it. Bring the ledger back here and do it swiftly. <coughs> we have not talked about my fee. And we won't. Not until the deed is done. You know how they are. Shocking. He is just a messenger. And you are still an errand boy. You can do this one on your own. I saw them with all the soldiers parading into the Winter Palace. Did they have swords and spears? Of course. Mutia, where has your smile run off to? What has happened? I do not want to talk about it. Ah, but I refuse to leave until you do. We need someone to offset the grouchy winds that billow from Durwish's quarters. Is he responsible for the clouds that hang above you? He shouted at me. Called me a harebrained miscreant. All because I roused a few guards who were pestering me. Harsh. I would have done the same as you. Do you think he will tell me to leave? Ah, Mutia. You do not know him as well as I. So I will only say this. Durwish may appear rough, but he has a soft underbelly. He's only trying to protect you. Still, some retribution is in order. What can we do? What can we do? Ah! Tomorrow, when all is quiet, we will sit on a nearby rooftop and stone his walls while he tries to sleep. <laughs> a brilliant idea! See you later, Basim! You are on your own, Basim. I do not wish for you to be upset. I took the contract, so I will see it through. I am not upset, Basim. I simply cannot understand why you overlook your own interests to serve theirs. You owe nothing to anyone but yourself. Remember that. This is no contract. It is a favor. I do not work for scraps. Did they say anything else about the ledger? Or why they want it? Uh, I tell you what they tell me, Basim. As always, it's just enough. Why are you asking? Huh? I would like to know just what it is I am contributing to. You have done much in the way of facilitating their endeavors. And so I will speak a word on your behalf. My one caution, and I have been doing this long enough to share it, anyone, anyone who works from the shadows does so only because they must. In the face of looming danger, for example, by working alongside them, we have invited the danger to our door. And we must be very careful not to let it in. 
Remember to pick up your feet, will you? What was the final tally of what we received? Sixteen crates, one chest, half a dozen satchels. Only three crates remain, last time I checked the ledger. Give their handlers until tomorrow evening. If they don't show by then, we must assume they've forgotten about their wares. Open them up. Keep whatever catches our eye. Dump the rest. Wait here. If I am seen, I will have to flee. Good thing I can outrun these sagging guards. Locked. A minor delay.
hell do I get inside? It's just a hidden place. Take a place on him. Keep at it. There. That may be what I'm looking for. this ledger holds. Maybe I can get the old Grouser to wish to squeeze a hint out of our contact. around the city. I'll see what I can do. <laughs> she looks important. You should haggle for a better fish. Oh, Basil, what timing? Did you get it? Without a fuss. <laughs> Give it here. You are one of them. Certain it is the chest you seek. I am certain. Hey, the boy. You need something stolen? I am your man. Your wish can attest. He has given me all your contracts. Then you have done your part. I can do more. Two of my best men died in this pursuit. I doubt a street thief would fare much better. Then let me join you. You have two openings. Take off this beef with that insult. 
Thank you, Darwish. Listen here, Basim. You want to keep working for me? You keep your head down and your mouth shut. <laughs> Why must you embarrass yourself like that? Like what? what? Like a beggar. Desperate for them to notice you. Desperate? Nihal, I am good at what I do. That woman would be lucky to have me. But she does not want you. You are a street thief with dirty feet. So why bother? Why keep pushing yourself down this path? Because being a street thief is not the peak of my ambition. I have more to offer this world than my nimble fingers. They just cannot see it yet. Almost, <gasps> Jessip. <laughs> What is this? Aha! Uh -huh. This is my latest creation. It helps me fend off angry merchants when they... Uh, catch me digging around their wares. I will consider myself spared. You smell foul. What is that? Ta! We have been fishing at the harbor since morning. Terrible luck, though. <laughs> the harbor? Did you happen to see or hear any fuss over a chest? Hmm. Ah, yes. A black one. Very beautiful. Some burly guards took it with them to the palace. Shukran laka ya What are you doing? They want that chest. And I am going to get it for them. Then they will see. There is just no getting through to you, is there? So. Then we will do this together. If you get caught at the Winter Palace, they will kill you on sight. We will need a safe way in. And I know where we might scout one. That is if you can bear to follow my lead for a change. Hey, kitty cat. Aww. Cute. You do not have to get involved, Nihal. I know your feelings on this. It is utterly foolish. But it seems I cannot stop you. So I will come with and nag you until you decide to abandon the idea of stealing a chest from the Khalifa's God, I'm having a cat. palace. When you say it like that, it only excites me further. Are we going or not? Not just yet. Tend to your things quickly then. You know I grow weary when I have to wait for you. Well, I don't have any missions yet, so... Have you readied yourself? Lead the way. This is a mad plan, Basim. Even if you were to succeed and they welcome you into their ranks, what then? Will you forget about us? Of course not. Nihal, their interests are our interests. You, me, and every other street dweller who has been cast aside. Living off scraps and dirty water. I can be an instrument that sees us out of that life. That sees that Jasip can use his talents to be a real craftsman. That sees that good men are not cast aside as my father was. And no children left wondering what tomorrow will bring. I hear what you are saying, Basim. But you paint a portrait of a world that cannot exist. That is where we disagree. Even if it can't, you gotta try. There it is, the Winter Palace. Come, this way. Right behind you. Even if you don't see a perfect world, it's always worth trying to work towards it. For everyone's sake. Here. 
Let us wait for nightfall. Does where you stand not awaken fond memories? Not so long ago, we were counting our spoils up here, under the cover of night. Just like this. The stakes were lower then. <coughs> and so too was the prize. Well, before you claim your prize, you will first have to reach it. As far as I can see, that will take some creativity. We could always try the front gate. You will have to let me know how that goes for you. Where are you going? I've had a clever thought. <coughs> if your mind is absent of one, you should perhaps follow mine. <coughs> Wait! <sighs> it is dark enough. <coughs> Come. yourself to my tail, Basin. Very sensible. I know how you hate to be alone. I see some guards just that way. I heard something. A low roar. Bees in my stomach. I really like create biasism now. This door may lead us inside. Not without a key, it won't. Mm. Have a look around. It is better this way. Any luck finding a key? Can I answer your question? 
settled. An unruly son is not helping matters. <coughs> the young man is eager. It's his first time in the palace, is it not? Let him wander, I say. Cater to his needs. They have arrived, Maulay. Out, all of you. I am to meet with them alone. Father, let me stay. Take him. <coughs> Looks heavy. We'll never get it out of the palace. Then I will just have to take what is inside. <coughs> it's probably an apple of Eden. Gentlemen, welcome. Everything is in order. I understand this means a great deal to you. Rest assured, it will be well protected here. We will accept nothing less. We will carry out our work and return to you when we are ready. <coughs> be prepared, Khalifa. Uh, might I see it once? The contents. If we are to guard this with our lives, we should know... I'm just gonna kill him. You saw nothing of this. Never mind. You say... Nothing. Do you understand? Yes, of course. Perish the idea. <coughs> now is our chance. Someone is coming. This way. Looks quiet. <coughs> I never thought I'd set foot in here. Just look at these arches. You could chisel off a piece and sell it for a hoard of gold. <laughs> Still like didn't effort. happen. Everything I can. <coughs> All right, Basim. Open. Open. Snatch. Snatch. Run. Basim, hurry. <laughs> oh, never mind. It's not an apple. It's a key. Basim! Give me that! No! 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 Do you have any idea what they will do to me? Please! I... I am sorry! This... This is your fault! Stop! Please! You thieving little rat! No! Run! Mihal, wait! Father! Get that boy! Oh, that's going to hurt the hands. Come on. What? What have we done? <coughs> hmm. 
<laughs> that guy just feels like that guy was just in over his head. He didn't know actually what uh, who we were dealing with. So probably didn't need to be killed. gone back home. Nihal, are you here? Yeah. Nihal? <laughs> Don't sleep, mate. I need you to tell me about this. I do not know what you mean. <coughs> tell me what happened. Silence is not your ally here. It is not silence. I cannot explain what I saw. That object. It did something to me. I was somewhere else, cold and frightened. Before I knew it, the Khalifa had his hands around my neck. I... It was an accident. I did not mean for it. Just wanted to help. We need to get you out of here. I have a boat at the Western docks. What? No, I, I cannot leave. I need to find Nihal. Ah, oh, don't tell me she joins Sink, the other side. The Khalifa's guard is searching for his murderer, a young thief of your description. They will not stop until they have found you. And when they do, it will not be a prison they throw you into. It will be a shallow grave. I'm giving you a second chance. Take it. <laughs> Nihal, Darwish. They are all in danger! The soldiers are hunting all who look like me. Damn it. <coughs> I didn't think they'd be on the roof already. <coughs> the soldiers are hunting all who look like me. <coughs>
Damn it, I didn't realize I missed two sides of Damn it! Fish, that was a lot of fish. Too late. Oh, damn it! from the palace also that you can impress your cunning friends i saved us you killed them you did this it came from over there <coughs> i hope i never see you again hurry all of them dead when it was me they sought to punish us i i i cannot be here i cannot <coughs> She got the jaw blades. She's gonna do one other. Is it him? I think so. Good enough. Am I gonna pick up a sword at least? At least he did it with his back. <coughs> I think he got winded though. Oh, if that's the fort, but I'll tell you. Yeah. Are you ready? I... Uh, I think so. Put yesterday out of your mind. It has no bearing on today. Get dressed and we can begin. Go on. 
Hangman Bastard. Hangman the White like Desmond Ghost. Yes, Master. <laughs> Steady, Basim. Steady. Lee. I've seen enough. We will try again tomorrow. Uh, I felt fine. I can see it in your body. You lose focus too easily. The leap of faith is a crucial step on your path to initiation. It is one of the Brotherhood's first and most sacred rites to perform it successfully. You must first center your mind, body, and spirit. Embrace the fear, <coughs> quiet it, find a stillness, and let go. Yes, master. Let's return to the camp. <coughs> may I ask you something? You may. Back in Anbar, at the palace, I witnessed a meeting between the Khalifa and five masked men. Order members. The Khalifa was meant to protect the object they discovered, but he knew nothing of their plans for it. He did not even know them by name. How does the most powerful man in Baghdad bend such a fearful knee to the faceless? You have held dominion over such men and their empires for centuries by convincing them of their truth, that they are the natural arbiters of the world. The Khalifa was but their puppet. And the same will be true of whomever succeeds him. The entire Khalafa is under their influence. Basim, speak with Fulav and see if he needs help. We will continue your training later. Yes, Master. Have you seen Mentor Rehan, Rekan? He is preparing. Good day, Tepet. Hello, Basim. What troubles you? Truthfully, I am frustrated. The Order has only grown stronger in Baghdad since the death of the Khalifa, and we are stuck on this mountain. Mentor Raihan surely knows what he is doing. Maybe I should trust more. Have you seen Fulal? Probably at his office, as usual. Anyways, I must get back to work. Araka Lahika. He is preparing to receive the Tahari emissary, Master. Thank you. I assume these, they're all speaking Arabic. How is Noor the brave eagle? Will he fall or will he soar? <laughs> you will soar, Excuse me. Habibi. Inshallah. Thank you. We have a similar spirit, you know. What gave you that idea? One of the Banu Musa was angry at you and you were unfazed. Remember? I did not touch his hammer. You refused to apologize for something you did not do. I respect that. Stubborn, like me. I have been called worse. Araka <laughs> Lahika. Ah, what is this in the corner? Here. Small design. It is my signature. So you know I created this, and not Al Hassan, or worse, Abu Jafar. <coughs> I guess you understand, Wadam. Ah, Basim, how are you? Yes, Enkidu, food is coming. <laughs> he is intelligent, and intelligence is supposed to rhyme with patience. <laughs> Remind me of someone. Have you been speaking to Master Roshan? Have patience. Be kind to your progress. I will take this to heart. Roshan asked me to come see you. Ah, yes. Rebecca needs leather strips. Can you fetch those from the storeroom? 
I shall, Fula. Rak Allah hai kaam. That is not it. It is hard to find anything in here. He probably has a system. It looks like ingots. Cough. These forces within the caliphate are beginning to put pressure on us. Forces? You mean the order, Raban? I can only speak of what I know, your Sardari. The Caliph wishes to nullify its rebels, and if you persist in giving them support, we cannot assure you protection <laughs> from the Caliphate response. The rebels supply us with information in Baghdad. Without them, we are blind. Be that as it may, Governor Muhammad is very committed to showing that he can end this rebellion swiftly. <laughs> I do not doubt that. I came to warn you. Things are moving fast in Baghdad. You may have to act sooner than expected. I hear you, Aban. So the Tahirids who govern these lands are the only thing standing between Alamut and a full-scale attack. A fragile peace. How long will it last? How does construction go? Uh, it is taking longer than we expected, Yasidi. That must be frustrating. Uh, Mentor Ryan is a wise man, but he speaks of this mountain as if it was destined that we build here. We have patience and follow his guidance. Master Roshan tells me I must not be in a hurry to rush back to Medina as Salam. I would not hurry at all. Baghdad is different now. It is very dangerous. <sighs> Rebecca? Basim, Basim. Are you just wandering the camp aimlessly now? No, I have this leather for you. Will it do? Apparently, you've moved past the wooden sword. I protested, but Roshan insisted. Here is your dagger. Oh, no, I hidden blade yet. And your sword. I am proud to have worked on them. This blade has character. Why would I make anything less than unique? I am in your debt. I was not expecting new weapons today. Repay me by using it on the order. Make them feel the sharpness of its character. Uh, how's my father? Had further training today. So are that new sword of yours. I look forward to it. Hello there. There we go. Okay. How does training go, Ya Sadiqi? Noor showed me a new way to grip my knife, and it has improved my accuracy greatly. 
If you throw it just so, it sails through the air, swift and true. Shall I remind you how to use a knife? Ya yeah, Elahi, well done. You have inspired me to Damn it. Assalamu salamu alaykum, ya sadiqi. Wa alaykum as salam Did Kulab send you? No, he did not. And you're not here to help move these rocks? I am quite sure that was not me. I do not mean to be rude, but I have no time to talk. I must figure this out. I will leave you to it then. I mean, can I not help him anyway? Apparently <coughs> not. I mean... Uh-oh. I just... There's all that progress, he said. Yeah. <sighs> <coughs> Good work until tomorrow. Basim? Time for combat training. I was surprised when Rebecca handed me this. Is a sword not a coarse weapon for a hidden one? As hidden ones, we must become proficient with a number of weapons. You never know how a fight will escalate. Anyone can wield a sword, but how would you use it? I am here to learn that, Master. Are you truly here? Well... <laughs> Yes, I believe so. You are here in body, but are you here in mind and soul? Is this a riddle? No, it is the difference between life and death. Make sure you target and circle around me. Never turn your back on your opponent. Yes, better. Show me your quick stabs first. Good. I'm waiting for you. Excellent. 
There are times when we must put more force into our attack to cause more damage. It will leave you exposed, so time it properly. Now go! <laughs> That's it! Come in strong. Excellent! Now, for defense, you can parry the attacks of your opponent. After a few successful parries, your opponent will be stunned. Try to parry my attacks. Yes! That's good. <laughs> Excellent. Some attacks cannot be parried and must be dodged instead. Prepare yourself. Damn it. Stay out of the Well done. Damn it. going to R2. Where did that come from? We are done for today, Basim. Why must we stop? I learned nothing from failing. True learning requires action and stillness in equal parts. You have made the action. Now, seek the stillness. Do not rush your training. Be patient. Failure is a part of progress. Uh -huh. Think on these words and come back better. Yes, master. I will. Do not fail. How do you know what's wrong? See you wrong? later. It's better you fail during training than real combat, where you might die. Ahmed will soon go back to the House of Wisdom. I fear he may end in the middle of a snake's nest. I know how close you are to your brother. We shall learn more soon. Then we can act. Assalamu alaikum, Abu Jafar. It is Ahmed. Ahmed, my apologies. Do not worry. Come and warm yourself by the fire. Our brother Ahmad is leaving us tomorrow. To Bagdad, the House of Wisdom. The House of Wisdom? We have been working there, my brothers and I, for years. I still have some things to work on. Science waits for no one. And I will fulfill my duty as a hidden one by becoming your eyes and ears among the scholars. Pula, tell Basim the story of the feather. Our tradition of the feather comes from Egypt. They represent the feathers of Ma'at. The feathers of the heron were dipped in the blood of the targets. These would be left for the Lord of the Duat to judge. It is important we remain humble and know our place in the process. We are messengers of justice. 
and not the final judges. Will anyone help me on patrol tonight? I will come with you. I must get my body moving if I'm to warm up tonight. I am grateful. Let us go. Are you coming, Basim? Leave the stories for later. May I speak to you in confidence? You know you can't. I overheard my... When emissary earlier... Mentor Rayhan asked if we may come under attack for dealing with rebels in Baghdad. Are we safe here, Alamo? I do not know. But I pity the people who attack this nest of eagles. But... Oh. How goes the watch? Nothing happening at all on Alamut, and I am so hungry. We did not make it to the main canyon. All right. Excellent. We will start there. Thank you. Come, Noor. Follow me. Sure, if it looks not real or too real. It's a point where it makes everything else look fake. Are you looking forward to your initiation? Yes. It feels like I have been preparing my whole life for this. I could not sleep the night before my ceremony. From excitement and a small bit of fear. If I am to be honest. We all fear the unknown. But a greater unknown awaits on the other side of initiation. You speak of the Order. I see them as monsters from a tale. That hiding in dark corners down dark alleys. The difference is that the Order is real. What do they... Oh. Didn't mean to cut that off. This is Moja. Magnificent. <laughs> Soon, you shall have one of your own. Fulav introduced me to an eagle named Enkidu. He said we have much in common, and not in a complimentary way. <laughs> that neither of them are patient. She sees something. Follow me. Does that not hurt your hands? Find a place to hide. Be ready. Stop. Quickly. I am behind you. We must strike fast. Agreed. We must wait for the right moment. Not like the wooden targets, is it? It is not that. This sword. What of it? Mercenaries from Baghdad use these weapons. We must warn the others. Probably too late.
Mercenaries from Baghdad. How do you know? Basim recognized the make of the sword. I believe him. Bring him in. How do you know these men were from Baghdad? Growing up on its streets, I have seen their weapons many times. And closely. Behind every mercenary is a man who gave them their orders. Yes, and we must act if we are to learn who that is. We will return to Baghdad, seek Ali ibn Muhammad's help. Ah, oh, of course. Sahib is Zen. He is a dangerous and delusional fool. Maybe so, but he is one of our only allies in Baghdad. We need him, and we need his men. I will go back to Baghdad. Go to Ali. Find out if the Order sent those men. I will. Wafakakallah. Wafakakallah. Wada'an. Araka lahiqan. He's ready. Oh, he's already done it. Assalamu alaikum, I must. He awaits me. Al Hassan, wrong again. It's Abu Jafar. I apologize. What are you reading? The works of a poet named Arif Al Ma'munia. Tabit was kind enough to lend it to me. I would recommend her highly. Now, if I may continue. Of course. I will leave you to it. Passam, go see my brother Al Hassan. You remember who he is, yes? 
Ah, oh, they're twins. How are you feeling on this auspicious day? It is strange, Al Hassan. My head is calmer than I believed it would be. I thought I would be a stormy sea inside. Right, you can't tell the two apart. Calm and quiet. Because you have dedicated yourself to your training and left nothing to chance. <gasps> Do I get Here, it? Basa, you have earned this. It oh. is a great honor. Is it what I, I think it is? Understand that. Roshan and the others are waiting for me. Go down. And thank you, Al Hassan. I wish I could just take a look into the cave room. Good day, Tabid. What are you busying yourself with? Have you heard about Iltani? One of the first of our founders. She assassinated Alexander the Great with an ingenious poison. I have attempted to recreate it from historical records. Oh. has taught me that no enemy is untouchable, no matter how powerful they appear. Thank you for this lesson. Wafakakallah. <laughs> I wish I could just take a look into the cave for a moment. This is a safe day for him. How are you feeling? Ready to make the leap? I wish you to know it has been an honor to watch you walk your path. As a novice, and as a man. I am grateful to you for leading the way before me. I am honored. Come, your new robes away. Ah, they suit you well. Come, it is time. How did you feel on that day so long ago? I felt afraid. <laughs> my palms were <laughs> slick with sweat and my knees were shaking. I cannot imagine you being afraid. Allow me to share a secret with you on this important day. To have courage means to act in the midst of feeling great fear. Is about to lose a finger. Can't remember which one it is. I think it's the third finger. Yeah. Middle finger. Are you ready to leave your life behind and walk the path of shadows? I am. Are you ready to give up who you once thought you were? Ready to sacrifice everything you held close? I am. Never forget the tenets you have sworn to uphold. Say your blade from the flesh of the innocent. Hide in plain sight. Never compromise the Brotherhood. Then, out of the dark, you will come into the light. And from the light, you will return to the dark. On that, it's a hot blade. They're instantly cauterizing it.
Uh, oh, it's the ring finger. I kind of saw it was the middle. Now follow in the eagle's path. Prepared. Left Baghdad in a hurry. Here, drink. <laughs> Ali, he is gone. They took him in the night. They, the order. Bring him to my tent. Hopefully he's just passed out and he didn't just If Ali is gone, spy. we are blind. The Order has put a fog over Baghdad and their movements. We must go to Baghdad. Roshan, Basim, go with Fulev. Leave at once. We should keep moving. I would like to look around first, if I may. Baghdad and its surroundings call to me. Very well, but do not be long. There will be much to do once we reach Harbiya. Look for a lattice-covered courtyard near Shara's mosque. That is where Noor was gathering his information. That is where we will be. Mm. Thank <laughs> you. 
Now, where does my heart take me? Hey, thanks for the follow. Such familiar sights. Greetings once again, Baghdad. Show me what I have missed. Hey. Go, Enkidu. Alright, so far I'm still pretty early in.
Ah, that's very classic. <coughs> so this is the Hidden One's Bureau. I expected some sort of hovel. Some bureaus are. Others can be fitted with gold trim. Wherever space we settle, all that's important is that our occupancy remains a secret. We certainly have that here. Have you found anything helpful? Nothing hinting at Ali's whereabouts. However, Noor was in contact with someone named Beshi. A name I recognize as one of Ali's closest allies within the Rebel Collective. He's a dock worker at the Upper Harbor. See if he's in the area. He may have something to tell us about Ali's disappearance. I have found something. Her voice sounds like it hurts. Seems Noor mapped out this very district. Marked the factory's area to the north. What is there? Rebel sympathizers. If Noor visited this area for any reason, it is worth following upon. Understood. These are not strong leads, but they are a start nonetheless. Fulab and I will see what more we can uncover. Be careful. Like, I know it's her real voice. Like, I've seen the actress in live action. No, thank you. Jesus, people, calm down.
I need your eyes, my friend. That may be Beshi rallying those side men. Side by side, we stand. And should one man fall, it is the one beside him who picks him up. <laughs> we have been cut down. We fight it. But here we remain. And so long as we draw breath, this fight will continue. Today, I see a great victory on the horizon. Guide me, Enki. <laughs> right. <laughs> Are you Bashi? I am with Noor. You knew him, yes? I knew him. Last I saw, he was being chased from the city. Does he live? Barely, but he is safe. Stubborn bastard. What do I call you? Basim. Very well, Basim. Have you a blade <laughs> other than that butter knife you carry? You may fancy yourself something bigger just now. For what? Are you setting off to find Ali? Not quite yet. These here are only half my men. The rest are being held at the Haba, further up the road. Right. There may be too few of us to wage an attack. If you want to save your men, our approach should be a cautious one. I will go, quietly. Have these men lie in wait and escort those we free. Your kind all think the same way. But it is a sound plan. <laughs> what see you, my friend? Some music is 
I need your help, my friend. Survey the area in Kido. I won't forget. Hey? What was that? Hold up! Yeah!
Hey. Won't run so well once I... Huh? Who's... Show me everything. What do you see? Fight smarter. Thank you. Get to the docks. Find Peshi. Thank you so much. That is the last. I must regroup with them.
The things that pass for art these days. Shadows. I'm kidding me, I left chest on the looted. Took about amateur hour. A chicken? <laughs> hmm. 
You are a hound, Basim. I am only doing my part. Together, we will see the end of what ails this city. Look no further than our ghoul. The man only spoken of and never seen. What can you tell me about him? He takes enemies of the Caliphate and makes them dig in the desert. Prisoners, rebels, laborers. What's he digging in search for? of what? I do not know. Probably, uh, he's These soon. men were captured with Ali oh. weeks ago and were destined Ruin. to perish beneath the sands. Not Ali. <laughs> he's been taken elsewhere. They marked and separated us. Ali was in another group. They wanted to question him about you and your friends. Can you show me this marking? What are you thinking? Ali and Noor got close enough to Al Ghul that he took notice. If we find Ali, he can lead us to Al Ghul. Mm. <coughs> it is but one path. There may be another. I will go where these men were being sent to dig and pose as a captive. Are you mad? <laughs> Only stubborn. Here, take this. What do I do with it? It is a Hidma token. Those who understand its value will do what is in their power to help. I will send these men to regroup at the water mill on the northern outskirts. A rebel stronghold. You are welcome there. Wafakak Allah. Barak Allah My search for Ali continues. The Sharia district may provide some clues as to his whereabouts. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
my Hellianta. Is there anything more you can tell me about the Sharia district? Why would it be of interest to Noor? The people there are in quiet support of the rebels. Common folk, <coughs> workers, merchants. Come to think of it, Noor did make mention of a new contact. A merchant. It may be this merchant dwells in Ashara, among the dying leather factory workers. I will keep an eye out for a stall. Disappointing in my countrymen today. Who shouldn't just leave money lying around? Asim? Azizi? I thought you were dead. I feared the same. What are you doing here? You? Your clothes? You are one of them now. How? A hidden one. Under Roshan's guidance. Forgive me. This is all too much. <laughs> when I did not find you among the dead, I hoped that somehow you had escaped. I spent many nights praying for your life, praying that you found safety. Today, Allah has answered me. I am not worthy of your prayers. 
What happened that night was not your doing. It was the doing of evil men. You know this. It is why you have chosen to walk this path. It is why I have found my way to Baghdad. Ali ibn Muhammad is brash and sees himself a great hero of prophecy. I loathe the man, but we fight a common enemy. One I must help defeat if my soul is to one day rest. So it is true. You are the rebel merchant who was helping Noor. What has become of him? He clings to life, but he is safe among our people. I am to continue his work and hunt Baghdad's oppressors. Ali was helping Noor get closer to one such man. But as you may know, he has since disappeared. He hasn't disappeared. He has been captured, a fate shared by many rebels of late. Do you know where he is being held? He was taken to the Khurasan Gate guardhouse. But that was weeks ago. You even leave like they do. It is good to see you again. Just watch yourself. You may be in better hands, but I'm still a nagging old man. And Basim, if ever you are feeling a little peevish, come see me. I could use your help uh, for a good cause, of course. Stepping a little bit more forgiving than that. This is the outpost Ali was taken to. <coughs> Lend me your eye. I saw that before. 
Are you and the scribe ever going to play nicely together? Not likely. The man thinks he can let loose his tongue just because of his rank. If he gets in my way again, I will kill him myself. And who will record the prisoners then? You? <laughs> you cannot pass in your own places, let alone write. <laughs> if it means we rid ourselves of his blithering, hey, I will happily learn. Please! Someone help me! <laughs> Hey, what's going on? Hold on! Stop. What do you see, Angel? Nothing to worry about. Hey, what's that? Hey! <laughs> with you?
find peace, warrior. That one looks like a scribe. Cast your gaze, Enkidu. like these old That was fucking cheap, that first catch. Or he was suddenly sitting down and then 
like he assassinated and it fucking attacked him instead. Show me the path ahead. Mother won't recognize. Huh? Who's your dad? Hey, I saw that before. Are you and the scribe ever going to play nicely together? Not likely. The man thinks he can let loose his tongue just because of his rank. If he gets in my way again, I will kill him myself. And who will record the prisoners then? You? <laughs> you cannot pass in your own places, let alone write. <laughs> if it means we rid ourselves of his blithering, I will happily learn. What? What was that? I require assistance. Wait, what? Nothing can hide from us.
Hold on. going on yeah. nothing here hey what's that hold on <laughs> This looks like a scribe's quarters. Hey! What was that? That one looks like a scribe. Hey! I will hold on to that for you. A list of prisons. All paired with different marks. Be my eyes, Enkidu. Not a dead horse.
مجنون كانك من سلاله Shannon Fulad will want to hear of these developments. If I were in Ali's position, I would do the same. An army is only as powerful as its weakest soldier. Assalamu alaikum, Basa. Wa alaikum assalam, Ahmed. How was your journey? I am Abu Jafar. Right. My apologies. Or is it triplets? Is there a problem? <coughs> Not yet. But we have discovered Ali was brokering a deal with Noor to supply the rebels with resources in exchange for his help. The order is a thorn in his side, yes, but Ali has his sights set on the Khilafa. He will want us to honor this deal. What news do you bring? Our target is Al Ghul. He uses prisoners and laborers to take around Baghdad. Ali and some of his men were captured and marked. <coughs> with Meshi's help, I freed them. But Ali had been taken elsewhere for questioning. One of the rebels showed me his mark. If this list of captives is correct, Ali was sent to the Damascus Gate prison. Where are these rebels now? A water mill, on the northern outskirts. I will meet with them. See what more I can learn about this deal. Find Ali. The Damascus Gate prison is the most well-guarded prison in Baghdad. This will prove to be no small challenge, I can tell you. I will scout ahead. Meet me near the prison's front gate. A moment of your time before you go, Basim. I have some useful thoughts to share. You have my ears. First, I have fashioned a board with information brought to us by our spies around the city. Consult it at your leisure. Second, these lands are ripe with materials to improve your weapons. See the blacksmith Jawad nearby. He could help you. And lastly, I am your man for any tool enhancement. Bring me materials, and you will see what mastery I can provide.
resourceful as always. My thanks, Abu Jafar. Fulad has gone ahead to scout a way into the Damascus Gate prison. I should find him, but before I do, it may serve me well to seek out this blacksmith. Any improvements he could offer would prove useful. Well met. Well met, sir. Let us see what you have got. Here's what I've got. Nothing further. I will see you later. <coughs> Be well, sir. Peace, friend. Be welcome here. Allow me to browse your stock. Please, take a look. Mm, we can make it stronger. Very well. Light? Is that it for now? I must take my leave. Don't be a stranger.
Good to see you. Well met. <coughs> May I see your wares? Here is what's in stock. I can give it a second life. Need a finer point? Is that all for now? What have you got today? Please have a look around. <coughs> got what you needed. I must be on my way. Please go with you. I'm going to go to the 
I've bought some of those pale long hair. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> Best I stay hidden. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Uh, sometimes. What do you have? Not all the time. Plenty of stock just now. <laughs> Never leave home without some. Very good, sir. Is... I have to go. Please come again. <laughs> Greetings. Be welcome, sir. May I see your wares? Take a look. I have a gift with edges. I know a thing or two about blades. I can improve the blade. Nothing else? I will be off then. Farewell then. Peace, friend. Good to see you. What do you have? Please, be my guest. Never know when these will come in handy. All right. Nothing else. I must be on my way. Farewell, sir. Good to see you. Nice to see you. Allow me to browse your stock. Here is what's in stock. I have a gift with edges. So. Is that all for now? I will see you later. So long.
Okay. I think I'm gonna leave it there. Um, tomorrow I'm gonna go play D and D. Uh, but later tonight I should be later tomorrow night. Um, I should be back on. So yeah. Until then, see you later. Bye.